What's up everybody? I got six juices from Dark City Vapor to review. We got the banana pudding. Burnout. Cake mix. Creamy Joe. White chocolate cappuccino. And the triple V. Now let's start off with the banana pudding. See what this smells like. It smells pretty much like some really sweet banana pudding. Really nice smell to it. It almost smells just like identical to the real thing. Um, when I vape it, uh, I'm getting more of a really sweet kind of vanilla wafer uh, cookie like taste more than I am the banana taste. Um, the banana taste is in there though, and it's not artificial candy tasting it is kind of like realistic tasting I'd say about like you know, like just a like really creamy banana that's not like you know like the candy banana it's more of a realistic banana but that that's kind of in the background the main flavor I'm getting out of it is just this really sweet really enjoyable like vanilla wafer kind of cookie pudding taste really good juice right here. If you're a fan of banana pudding, I would definitely recommend it. Now the burnout. Let's see what this one smells like. Really, really, really strong cinnamon. It smells just like, like red hot, sort of like a fireball. Um, when I vape this one, I almost can't vape it. This damn thing blows my head off big time. It's like taking, you know, it's just like vaping a fireball. It's really, really extreme vape. You really gotta love fireballs, red hots, and cinnamon to enjoy this juice. Um, the, the nicotine in it is 18 milligrams, but when I take a hit off of it, it's almost like over 36 milligrams. It just, I can't even take but like a half a hit. Like my normal hit, I can't even take but like half of a hit, and it's just kicking me in my throat so hardcore. Um, really not an all day vape for me. This is like a, just a vape to like. If you're having a bad taste bud day or something like that and you just want to get out some juice that'll knock your socks off of flavor then this is what you you know want to go for uh, I'd recommend it only if you're a fan of really extreme uh, red hots or like a fireball really really strong cinnamon juice now the cake mix it smells just like a cake just like a good old birthday cake. It's not that yellow spice cake that you'll find from some vendors. When I vape it, it's just a really nice, not too sweet cake, like gooey cake uh, batter kind of taste to it. Um, that's about all I'm getting out of it. A nice strong vanilla tone to it. Um, kind of like a little touch of uh, vanilla butternut icing. Um, it's just like sticking your fingers in cake mix and licking it. That's what it tastes like when I vape it. It's a really, a really nice flavorful vape. I know most um, vapes I get like this, like vanilla or whatever, they won't have that much flavor to them. But um, Dark City Vapor did the cake mix perfectly. So if you're a fan of uh, that kind of flavor, of nice icing cake mix kind of taste, then you definitely want to go for this one. This is one of my favorites out the bunch. Now the Creamy Joe. Let's see what this one smells like. It kind of smells like burnt popcorn. Getting getting a kind of like a coffee smell from it, like uh, burnt roasted coffee beans kind of. When I vape it though, it really reminds me a lot of like kettle corn, like sweet kettle corn. I don't know, it tastes just like some um, maybe burnt popcorn with kettle corn mixed in with it. Doesn't really taste all that much like a coffee vape. I mean, it does have that that coffee texture to it. But um, it's a really strong vape too. It, it'll, it's on up there in the flavor. Um, when you hit this, you definitely know what you're vaping on. Um, I wouldn't recommend it if you're looking for just a straight up coffee vape because I'm getting more of a, a kettle corn kind of popcorn taste out of it. I mean, that's just my take on it. I'd recommend it to you if you're a fan of uh, like kettle corn mixed with cappuccino, something like that. Now the white chocolate cappuccino. Let's see what this one smells like. 
really good sweet smell to it. I can smell some vanilla in it, some white chocolate. The white chocolate that's in it, when I vape it, it doesn't taste like like brown chocolate at all. It's just got this really nice vanilla type chocolate taste to it. Along with this really mild cappuccino. The cappuccino the taste that's in it is really not all that strong. It's um, uh, Really, it's a damn good cappuccino vape. I'd recommend this one to you if you're a fan of a light vanilla white chocolate taste mixed with just the perfect touch of cappuccino um and it's just a, a nice sweetness to it it's you know not over the top it's just a, a damn good white chocolate cappuccino juice definitely recommend it now the triple v this is my favorite out of all of them by far this is a uh, supposed to be a vanilla flavor it smells like kind of like the cake mix does it smells almost identical to the cake mix but when I vape it it's stronger it's like cake mix times 10 or something like that I don't know it's like it's a really the strongest vanilla flavor ever I've tried vanilla flavors from all sorts of vendors and usually they're all just bland taste and you really cannot taste the you know the vanilla notes in it because it's just a it's a hard flavor to recreate when vaping but uh, somehow Dark City Vapor, they put some vanilla flavor in this that will just blow your mind. This right here is a must try. If you're a fan of vanilla or like cake juices, anything like that, you're going to love the Triple V. Now I got all six of these from DarkCityVapor.com. I'll give you a link in the description like always. I guess that's it. Thanks for watching everybody. And vape on.